way. You know what you have to do. Got it. And Frank, you don't want to fuck this up. Okay. Where are we going, Frank? Forward. Going forward. Hey, but been working on Rosie's present. Birthday present for Saturday? Uh, it's one of my drawings, you know, the comics, the funnies. I think she's really gonna like it. Saturday's off, Mickey. Why? Change of plans. You mad, Frank? No. I did exactly what Uncle Jimmy asked me to do. The thing, the other night, if that's what you're mad about, Frank, I swear, I'm there, I'm sitting at my post, Doyle comes over the radio, and he's telling me that the Miller ladies got all kinds of diamonds in a panty drawer. And then all of a sudden, he's screaming, Mickey, Mickey, help me, Mickey! You no know one had him? Right? Mickey just... No, no, I mean, I'm not lying, I swear to God, you know what? God, a cat. A cat? Yeah. You believe that, Frank? So a cat killed Doyle, that's what you're telling me. No. I, I ran out to the car to get the, the you know, the, the first aid thing, and then and, uh, somebody got in behind me, must have, and just got Doyle. Give me heart from Mickey, you know that? I gotta take a leak, Frank. Oh, you have to hold it. No, I mean, I really gotta go. Like, I've got pissed like a Clydesdale. A whiz all over the seat. Hey, Frank, why is Saturday off? I really wanted to give Rosie a drawing. Mickey. What, is she four now? Five. Five. She ain't a little girl no more, is she, Frank? Oh. Look at this. Is she beautiful? How an ugly mug like you ever crank out such a pretty little girl. <laughs> Got me, Mickey. Frank, can I ask you a dumb question? Sure. Do you ever think of doing something, I don't know, different? Yeah, pal. Listen, we need to get back. Shh. You hear that? No. Over here, over here. Chippy. 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 <laughs> we got a chippy. Oh, Mickey. Mickey. Chipmunk. Of course, obviously. Why wouldn't we be chasing a chipmunk through the woods? There you are. Hope this is fun for you, Mickey. Really hope you're enjoying yourself. Do you mind, Frank? I got him. Frankie, baby, I got him! Holy shit, cakes! You're an idiot, you know I'm that? I'm a chipmunk holocaust. That's what I am, baby. <laughs>
I don't even see it. <laughs> Imagine that, man. <laughs> they're out there, and they're praying for salvation. For, for salvation from me, Frank. The Chipocalypse. <laughs> You never change, Mickey. <laughs> Can you imagine that, man? If every night all the little chipmunk families were gathered around in the horror and the mortal <laughs> terror, and they, and they call out, Dear Lord, <laughs> deliver us now. <laughs> deliver us from the kingpin, Mickey Kelly. <laughs> chipmunk serial killer. How funny would that be, man? You know, there's a reason your uncle never let us do nothing but sit look out. And that poor bastard's lying over there. And he looks up and he says to me, he thinks all back right. on his poor chippy life and all he can think is, damn, that was boring. <laughs> Come on, let's get back to the car. And he looks Come up on, at Mickey. me and he says, he's bleeding out. And he says, he says to me, please take care of my wife and puppies. Mickey. <laughs> do you know that, Frank? That uh, baby chipmunks are called puppies? I mean, puppies. It's like they couldn't at least get something. Mickey! Shut up! Sorry. Don't keep saying you're sorry. Where are we going, Frank? How long have we been working for your Uncle Jimmy? Tell me where we're going. Since we're kids. Since we're kids, and all we're ever trusted with is sit and look out. <laughs> years and years and years, and I've been never given a chance. It's all I ever wanted for us, Mickey. Why'd you bring me out here? You sure you ain't mad at me? You know what your problem is? You know what your problem is? And I want you to remember this. Huh? You know what your problem is? Yeah. You know, I know. what your problem is? I know, I'm dumb and I'm not smart. And, uh, I'm trying, all right? Hey, you think a bitch, yo? You stupid man, I'm sorry, you man, stupid shit, man. You stupid slick shot, you stupid I'm fucking shit, man. You killed him, Mickey. No, 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 I told you. I, w I went out to get the thing and somebody must have come in the house. Don't fucking lie to me! It's an accident, Frank. You're a drawing. No, man, no. You were drawing and you missed Miller. Miller comes home, finds Doyle. They begin to fight. Doyle gets on the radio, calls for help, and you rush in there with that fucking gun of yours. It's not fair, man! Oh! Mickey, you know how your uncle runs things? Why'd you bring me out here? Okay. I see why you think you need to do this, man, but you just... No, just let me, let me say this, Frank. All right? When I was a kid, all I ever wanted to be was like a drawer or an art guy or something. Like in the comics or the Sunday funnies. All this B&E stuff, all these jobs we pulled for Uncle Jimmy, I, I just did that because he wanted me to, man. Because it was fun palling around with you. I'll make it just... When Doyle got shot, I knew I had it coming. I just didn't think it was going to be today. I didn't think it was going to be you. Can you do something for me? Can you give this to Rosie for me? It's her birthday present. I know I got a lot of work to do on it, man. But you got muscles, 
and you're strong. And I really like to cape. Frank. I understand. I understand why you gotta do this. So it's okay. Okay? Okay. Adolfo's got $5,000 in it. You head to Canada. Go to college. Get you on a strip in the funny papers for all I care. Not just for something other than this. <laughs> 